Welcome back, Bittisons. Tonight, Luna, are you contacting a ghost? Because if not, kindly shut the f up. Tonight, we're returning to BitLife, the app where you live your life through an app. No consequences of real life are involved. Want to become an adult film actor and get a Brazilian butt lift that's botched? But don't want to face the repercussions at the family reunion? Do it through BitLife. Hey, it's Lucas. Welcome back to the Chan Chan. I've played BitLife in the past. A lot of you guys have been telling me to return. Apparently, there's been some updates. It has come to my knowledge you can now become famous on BitLife. I've already tried to have a hundred babies on BitLife. I failed miserably. I had like six. I tried so hard to get knocked up and it only happened six times. I think my plan's gonna be like get a Brazilian butt lift, start an Instagram, download Facetune, and like maybe have a secret relationship with Drake Bell and just like hope that it leaks to the press. This plan's gonna work. You know what to do. Click that sperm and start a new life. <laughs> I'm Charlotte Hillary. I'm born in New Zealand. Oh my God, Lord. Time to get in a scandal involving Lord to get famous. This is creepy. My birthday is August 29th. I'm a Virgo. That's my actual birthday. Is this some Black Mirror shit? Oh my God. I really hope my parents in this game didn't vaccinate me. So when I'm 18, I can go on Instagram and be like, I'm suing my parents for not vaccinating me and like go on the news. Maybe get on the Tyra Banks show. Kiss my fat ass. <laughs> Is this game listening to me? People said BitLife updated. Does the update involve listening to you? I was just talking about vaccinations and now, what? Your mother is taking you to the doctor to get vaccinated. It's official, I'm on an episode of Black Mirror. I'm gonna throw a conniption fit because like I said earlier, I do not wanna be vaccinated so I can sue my parents in the future and get famous on Instagram slash Snapchat. The clout of it all. You just got your first period. How will you react? I don't know. Get a pad? Isn't that the normal thing to do? I'm gonna tell my mom about it. I'm 13, I just got my period, and I can start a social media. Everyone's doing it. You sign up for a social media account. Well, it says I have zero drunk pictures on my social media. I'm 13, so I would mother hope so. You posted on social media. Your post got zero likes. It's okay, you gotta start somewhere. My status update got two likes, and I'm 14 years old. I'm a 14-year-old bisexual, and my status update just got liked by two people. Things are looking up. Six likes? Okay. It's growing. I'm starting a business, parents. Oh, three likes. It's it's fluctuating. I'm worried. Teen love, you are now going out with Grace Young. Can I post photos on Instagram with my girlfriend? Couple photos do great. But if you're a lesbian couple, they do amazing. My girlfriend and I are both 15. And I'm gonna propose to her for social media clout. She rejected me, even better. I'm 15 and I proposed to my 15 year old girlfriend and she rejected me. In parentheses, lesbian. That would get so many views. Number one trending on YouTube. I just asked out a a guy named Lucas and he rejected me. He tells you that you remind him of his cousin. Fair enough. If somebody reminds you of a family member, you probably don't want to be romantic with them in an intimate way. I'm now looking through the job listings to find something that could potentially get me famous because that's the goal we're trying to do today. We have a few options. Makeup artist, become James Charles. Background vocalist, become Demi Lovato. Deacon at a church, become Katy Perry. She started out like singing at church. Exotic dancer, become Trisha Paytas. I also could become a a pharmacist and become Lil Xan. Just like talk about Xanax all the time. There's so many options, shit. I'm gonna become an exotic dancer because just feel it in me. The people who work at the Carpe Diem Club laughed at your resume before throwing it in the trash. Whatever, I'll be a backup vocalist. Rejected? I can't be Demi Lovato or Trisha Paytas, it turns out. I just got worried and did some Googling and apparently to get famous, I have to go to community college. They said allegedly that'll help you get some of those famous people jobs. They also said I need to be going to the gym, which I have not been doing. And apparently I also need to meditate because apparently like you just need a clear mind to really get hot on Insta, you know? And they said your looks matter a lot. I'm a 62%. This isn't good. I'm now 18 and I only have 206 followers and zero drunk photos. It's okay, Ellen got the Ellen show at 45. I have time. It's gonna be fine. So I'm gonna start working as a porn set janitor because apparently you get promoted and like eventually you'll be the star. You can become famous on social media from that. I'm now working at Willow Studios as a porn set janitor, cleaning up the sets. 
after they do the dirty. I'm happy, I'm thriving. Honestly, I'm so stressed because there's so much to focus on. My porn job, my gym, my social media, my sugar daddy, my plastic surgery. Like this is more stressful than real life 100%. Oh my gosh, I just applied to become a DJ and I got it. I'm now working at a record label called Chrome Records. I'm only 19, I've tried to become the next Lele Pons, I've tried to become a porn star and now I'm gonna become the next Zed. I'm doing a lot. Oh. Your ex-girlfriend Grace just sent you a sultry bikini pic. What do you do? Send her a text back. You sent her back a nude pic of your privates covered in whipped cream. Creative and tasty. This is risky, but I'm now gonna attempt to get a Brazilian butt lift for Instagram. It was botched. I'm now so ugly. I'm 20 years old and I'm ugly. Without a Brazilian butt lift, how could anyone live like this? Time to get more plastic surgery to redo this. It was botched again? I am done. Okay, I got a liposuction though and it was pretty good. My looks are still 8%. I'm not gonna be able to be famous. It's time to vaccinate your daughter. I'm not, I'm against vaccination. She's gonna be covered in essential oils. She'll be fine. Your fling, Jay Jacob is coming on to you. What will you do? Let him hit or actually never mind? I'll let him hit. You had a one night stand with your fling and I didn't enjoy it at all. It was not a good session. And I now have gonorrhea. I love life. And I'm pregnant. This is so stressful. Whatever, I'm just gonna get some more plastic surgery. Oh no, they said they cannot perform a breast implant surgery because I'm pregnant. All right, it's time to give the baby up for adoption or something. My baby has been born. Her name is Kim Possible. My breast augmentation was successful, but I'm still ugly. The liposuction was successful, but I'm still ugly. Is it not in my fate to be an Instagram model? My baby daddy, Jacob, sent me a picture of his bulge. I forwarded it to all of my friends, but I'm still ugly, so none of it matters. Someone attacked me on the street, so I fought back, and now I'm facing a year in prison. I can't, I'm now in prison. And I've been fired from the record label. I'm now free from prison, and my boyfriend wants me to go on birth control. This is sad. Well, I'm now a DJ again. They didn't even care that I went to prison. In fact, they loved it. They preferred it. I just asked my dad for money, and now I'm getting a Brazilian butt lift because after prison, you need to get some surgery to just like feel back to normal, you know? Okay, I'm slowly getting hotter. I'm 30 years old, I still have time to become a social media influencer. I now have 800 followers since I got a Brazilian butt lift. I got a tummy tuck and now I'm 85% hot. My social media numbers are going up. All I need to do is get plastic surgery to get famous is what we're learning. I just got a tummy tuck and I'm now 100% hot. But my social media isn't growing. What the f I read online how to do this and it's not working. I guess I'm gonna try to be a foot model and hopefully work up to being like a face model. No one reached out to me, but I have 100% good looks. Whatever, I'm a DJ at a new record label. I've hit a thousand followers on social media. Media. It's starting to pick up. I'm 35 years old. I still have time. I'm a little bit stressed. All these Instagram bitches are teenagers and I'm 35, but I'm still, I can still make it. Shit. How do you get famous? All I'm doing is posting on social media and it's not rising. I'm gonna have to get a new job. Okay, I'm now a puppeteer because DJing wasn't getting me famous. I'm now gonna be the most famous puppeteer the world's ever seen. I'm getting nervous. Like I'm trying so hard. I've been working. I work harder every time at my job. I click clicking work harder and it's not working. I go to the gym every single day. I'm so hot. Oh my God, lead actor. Now that I've been a puppeteer, they might let me be a lead actor. They denied me. We're going back to porn. I'm starting as a janitor, but we're gonna work our way up this system. We are a MILF, we have two kids. We've gotten divorced a few times. We're 39, it's not too late. The followers are slowly rising, like 20 a year. It's all happening. Your daughter Thong has just come out of the closet as bisexual. Support her unconditionally. Aw, who cares about my daughter? Unless you're gonna let me do a YouTube video about you. I don't care. Cause all I care about is social media and it's, it's not going well. I'm now 42, my dad died, skip the funeral. You guys, I don't even know if you realize how hard I'm trying. I accidentally forwarded a naked picture of myself to everyone I know and it didn't even get me Famous. Okay, I'm now 46. It's not too late. That's when Ellen started the Ellen show. So I, I still, it's fine. It's fine. I'm dating someone. I don't care if you broke up with me. I haven't talked to you in like a decade. I'm now 50 years old and I've sometimes wondered how it would feel to be a tortoise. My social media followers have plateaued. My job is not promoting me to a porn star. I'm just the historian. This really sucks. I just got dumped. Now my vision's going bad. I'm now getting married to this girl named Ava Clark because she's rich and I have nothing else to do. We don't need a prenup. I'm gonna change my name to her name. Maybe that'll boost my social media because nothing else seems to be working. I've lost followers. I'm 53 years old. My porn job is not working out. I'm going to the nightclub 
and I'm letting loose. The bouncer won't let you in because I'm old. This world is a tough place. You are suffering from constipation. And I post about it on social media to go viral. Now I'm betting $5,000 on a horse race just to feel something. I lost. I don't even give a shit. You know what? I'm hot. I'm happy. I'm healthy. My job is not progressing. Time to spice it up. I don't know what to do, but I still have hope of getting famous on social media. Remember that lady who put on that Star Wars mask or whatever and got famous? I could do that. Why isn't there an option for me to do that? I am gonna pickpocket someone just to feel something. Your mom died. Your wife offers you vodka that you've never tried. I'm 74 and I've never tried vodka. While walking downtown, you come across a grocery cart filled with what appears to be ecstasy. I... I'm going to sell it. You were caught trying to sell a grocery cart full of ecstasy. I have depression. Same. My wife died and I got $200,000, but it doesn't matter because I'm not famous. I thought I was gonna be big time rush. You died after suffering a stroke at 86. I had $600,000 worth of money though. Well, I'm not sure what the f I did wrong, but I didn't become famous even kind of. What the hell? I searched how to do it and they said either become a DJ, a model, anything in pornography. I tried it all. I tried it all. None of it worked. I even got hot. I posted on social media. I did everything. At least I was rich. Well, thank you guys for coming along on this very depressing journey. Don't forget to comment below how many times you've gotten rejected to be an exotic dancer and it hurt your feelings. Bye, bitch!